and then once you come back you know your time is your personal time which wasn't the case uh, when we were the field level functionaries and it also changed over a period of time and also changed depending upon if there is a uh, if there is a natural calamity which has happened in your district then we know there was no day there was no night for us if there are elections going on there was no day no night for us Hi uh, everyone, my name is Kundan Kumar. I belong to 2004 batch of Indian Administrative Service and my cadre is Bihar and I'm also a native of that state. I remember, you know, my days as an aspirant. My days as an aspirant never changed, you know, because it was always studies, studies and studies because there was so much to study, there was so much to cover that, you know, we used to wake up with books and we used to sleep with books. Contrary to that, you know, when uh, we got into the service, uh, our typical day started playing out differently. Though it wasn't the same, but a part of the day, uh, which was the morning part of the day, I somehow kept it almost the same throughout my career. It is because, you know, I am very passionate about sports, I am very passionate about uh, fitness, I am very passionate about uh, morning routine. And therefore, you know, in the last 20 years, you know, the morning part of my day has more or less, with few exceptions, have remained the same. Where I wake up early, I go and play a sport, depending on the time that is available. And then I generally plan my day after I finish my sport as to what I'm going to do for the rest of the day. The morning part of my days across my length of the service has remained the same. While the part which one is supposed to spend in the office has not remained the same, I must say. It was the assignment, you know, it was the responsibility which was given. It was the, the job that I was doing primarily shaped the later part of the day after the morning. You know, uh, when we were SDM or the district magistrate, we were not sure of uh, whether we will be able to spend the whole day in the office or do everything that we had planned where we were supposed to do our court, where we used to help hold our courts, then uh, meet uh, people, uh, dispose of files. That has never remained the same because district and subdivision is a dynamic entity, you know, it, uh, depending upon the law and order situation, depending upon, depending upon how the, what all activities, depending on the visitors to our important people coming to our uh, district, you know, the days used to be different from each other. But a typical day during my early days was 10 o'clock in the office where we used to dispose files and then a couple of meetings where uh, we used to spend time with uh, different departments, so, say health, education, agriculture, because as, as, a, as a collector, one gets to see, one gets to review and supervise and monitor all the sectors and all the departments of the district. So a typical day uh, while I was collector was morning, my morning routine. The day used to be meetings, files and some inspections of an institution or inspection of some offices. And by the time, you know, one gets uh, used to get back to the to the residence, then work never used to stop. And therefore, I used to have only an hour or so to again, you know, to relax myself and sit back in in my residential office, which is which uh, uh, which is called confidential office or Gopniye Karyale. And that was that at, in some of the states also called camp office. So a typical day of a collector is my daily routine was morning exercise, morning fiz, uh, fitness, looking after some of the projects which were very dear to me and meetings in the daytime, disposing of files. And as I used to come back to the residence in the evening, the work never used to stop because, you know, we had so much of work to do that, you know, we used to finish our work, say, by 10, 30, 11 in the night. So the day, the entire day used to be very long, right from 5 o'clock in the morning till 11 o'clock in the night. That was a typical day of a collector. But as one start uh, getting senior in the service, one used, one used to get uh, assignment in the state capital and in the and in the national capital with the central government, with the state government, is when the field level things, you know, go out of your typical day. And your typical day, again, can start with uh, morning exercise, morning routine. And then you one is mostly confined to the office 9 to 5 or 9 to 7. 
and then once you come back you know your time is your personal time which wasn't the case uh, when we were the field level functionaries and it also changed over a period of time and also changed depending upon if there is a uh, if there is a natural calamity which has happened in your district then we you know there was no day there was no night for us if there are elections going on there was no day no night for us so i would say today i have a much more relaxed day than what it used to be while i was in the districts as as collector i have for a very long period now i was also ps to the central ministers where again you know your your life is almost like or your routine is almost linked to the routine of your boss there again you know one has to be very careful and one has to be mindful of the needs of your boss and then plan your day having given the description of a typical day of an ias officer i would uh, i i can say with a lot of certainty that uh, i i put in efforts i tried my level best not to disturb my morning routine because as i told you i was very passionate and i'm a i'm still very passionate with my morning routine and i always tried to do my morning session not withstanding how the night was how difficult was the night you know i used to get up early finish off my morning routine morning exercises sports and then i was very careful and mindful of the day of the way you know i am spending my time in the office where i used to mix up my meetings my supervision and inspection so that i can try and finish my day by say 6 or 7 so that you know i can have some time for my family as well so it is very important to be disciplined about your about your routine also because only when one is disciplined one would be able to follow one's passion despite the busy and hectic schedule one as officer has i think with this description i'm sure you no know, i uh, was able to give you uh, some insight to all of you into a typical day of an as officer which i told you, you know it's not same always but one should one must try to balance everything so that you know you you have a perfect work and life uh, balance